And it is for the WWE Women's Championship. But the action continues live and in living color here in the Coliseum as the WWE Women's Championship from Monday Night Raw is set to be defended. And approaching the aisle, the number one contender. Some are already predicting a superstar that'll be the breakout star of 2024. The Buff Barbie, Tiffany Stratton, arrives here in San Juan, Puerto Rico with one mission in mind, to leave with an emphatic mark made on the WWE Women's Championship. And to remind the Monday Night Raw Women's Division that it is 1,000% tippy time. Stratton competed in the Elimination Chamber match a few months back, really turned some heads ever since. Really had her breakout moment on the first Raw of the season in Madison Square Garden last month, winning the eight women over the top rope battle royal to secure her number one contendership. Stratton's been doing all she can to try to get into the mind of the champion Liv Morgan over the last few weeks, but I don't know if you're gonna be able to get into the mind of somebody who is mentally tough enough to bounce back from her loss to Rhea Ripley at the Royal Rumble earlier this year and come and fight Rhea Ripley once again at WrestleMania and win that very championship. Certainly a lot of questions that we await answers to as Liv Morgan walks down the aisle with the WWE Women's title that she won last month at AT&T Stadium. We have seen Liv Morgan compete on Monday Night Raw, but this is her first championship defense since WrestleMania. You gotta wonder if there's any butterflies in the system, because it was last year, Liv Morgan's WWE Women's Championship reign ended in her very first defense by Shayna Baszler. Gotta wonder if history will repeat itself. Will Liv Morgan be able to get through the butterflies, retain her title in her first defense tonight, or will we be living on Tiffy time after Backlash. Introducing the challenger from Fire Lake, Minnesota, Tiffany Stratton. And her opponent from Elmwood Park, New Jersey, the WWE Women's Champion, Liv Morgan. Well, I'll tell you, the momentum may be on the side of the number one contender tonight, winning the Battle Royal last month, and most importantly in my eyes, winning the six-woman tag team matchup this past Monday night on Raw. Stratton alongside Chelsea Green and Sonya Deville able to take down Liv Morgan, Roxanne Perez, and pinning Cora Jade in the match. Tiffany Stratton may have the upper hand over the champion tonight. All remains to be seen. As Asia Smith sounds the bell, excuse me, we are underway with our WWE Women's Championship match at Backlash. It's Stratton right out of the gate. Tiffany Stratton, as we mentioned, the Battle Royal victory last month, the six-woman tag team victory this past Monday. Owns a victory as she begins to try to pick apart Liv Morgan here. Tiffany Stratton owns a victory over Roxanne Perez a few months ago on Raw, of course, as we mentioned. Competed inside the Elimination Chamber matchup back in January. Stratton's been making some waves in 2024 so far, but can she capitalize here tonight and win the WWE Women's title? On the other hand, you got Liv Morgan. As we mentioned as she was walking down the aisle, you got to believe that the mind game Stratton has tried to play may not have worked. Liv Morgan clearly mentally tough after getting demolished, let's call it as it is, and Liv Morgan would tell you the same by Rhea Ripley back in January at the Royal Rumble, only to bounce back back at WrestleMania to defeat Rhea Ripley and win the championship she now holds. Liv Morgan has been to rock bottom, and as much as Tiffany Stratton wanted to tear her down by getting in the mind, going face to face, trying to take her off her game over the last few weeks, I don't know if it might have worked. Liv Morgan almost getting a knockout blow and going home early, but Tiffany Stratton, former NXT Women's Champion, got a little bit more left in the tank. Certainly gonna be a great matchup between the possible future breakout star and the number one contender, the agile, the young, the hungry Tiffany Stratton, and sometimes downright extreme and gritty champion in Liv Morgan. 
Did go to the top here. May have been a misstep as Tiffany Stratton pushing her off. Now Stratton again trying to scurry up. Get the pinfall. Tiffany trying to win the title and get the hell out of Dodge tonight. Wrestling Liv Morgan over her shoulders here. Stratton and O'Connor the buff Barbie for nothing. A nickname earned because of the strength and agility that Tiffany Stratton houses. Some may say a full package inside of that ring. And many would not argue. Gonna be a future champion without a doubt, but the question is, will she win the gold here tonight? And so far, this matchup has been majority in the house of the number one contender, Liv Morgan, may be feeling the pressure of the championship moment here tonight. We talked about it a few moments ago as well. Liv Morgan, of course, won the WWE Women's Championship against Asuka last May. But in her first defense as champion, lost the gold to Shayna Baszler last June. And Liv may be on the verge of history repeating itself. Her first title defense almost going up in smoke that time. Liv looking to prove some doubters wrong tonight. Many have called the matchup at WrestleMania against Rhea Ripley a fluke victory. Liv trying to prove that she is a deserving champion here tonight. Able to muscle the shoulder off the canvas after some great offense by Tiffany Stratton. And the frustration of Stratton that time may have costed her. Now Liv going for the Irish whip. Another sidestep by the number one contender. Tiffany Stratton is on Tiffy time tonight. She may have the number of the champion. I am sure she has done her scouting over the champion Liv Morgan. Saw what she brung to the table against Rhea Ripley at WrestleMania. Watched up close and personal the matchup against Sonya Deville a few weeks ago on Raw. And then of course we saw the preview this past Monday night in the midst of that six woman tag team match. Stratton pinned Cora Jade this past Monday night. A victory over the champion however tonight awards the gold to the now number one contender. And Liv Morgan is struggling to truly hold the offense in this match. Tiffany Stratton dictating the pace if I say so myself. Liv Morgan may just be feeling the pressure, may be feeling the butterflies. Is the moment too big for the defending champion? Stratton back into the ring. Liv Morgan creating some distance. Might have worked out for her that time. Drop toe hold here. Liv Morgan trying to get things going. And maybe it's reversing the psychology against Tiffany and getting in the number one contender's mind here at Backlash. I don't know if you want to throw hands with Liv Morgan. She has proved to be gritty and downright effective. Cora Jade tried this strategy a few weeks ago on Raw. Did not work out for the generation of Jane. It ended pretty similar like that. Another cover by Liv Morgan, and unfortunately for her, only on one count. Liv Morgan has got to keep this offense. She's got the momentum on her side momentarily, but as we have seen throughout this matchup so far, Tiffany Stratton has really not allowed the champion to get going. Live on the middle buckle, not afraid to risk it all if it means retaining the title here tonight. Missile drop kick, damage done to the challenger. Liv Morgan will stomp over Tiffany Stratton if it means leaving San Juan, Puerto Rico with her title. But once again, Tiffany Stratton taking down the champion. Stratton did her homework. May have the answers to the test tonight. Swanton Bomb. That's going to do it. New champion on the horizon. Not to be just yet. Liv Morgan still holding on to her title another moment. Man, Stratton so close from victory that time. Swanton Bomb off the top. You got to believe the challenger thought that was it. Never us underestimate Liv Morgan. We have seen so far in 2024 what she is capable of coming back from. From rock bottom of Monday Night Raw to the champion of Monday Night Raw. But will Stratton play spoiler here tonight? Swanton Bomb did some offense, or I should say did some damage to Liv Morgan. May not have gotten the victory. It is certainly paying Tiffany some dividends right now as the beatdown continues dead center of the ring. Stratton's just got to keep this up. If she keeps the momentum, 
in her corner. Keeps the pressure on the champion. At some point, Liv Morgan's going to give in. Very well could be living in tiffy time after tonight. Wait a minute here. This is the maneuver that put away Cora Jade in the midst of the Battle Royal a few weeks ago. The cover to Liv Morgan. Another close call. Frustration coming out of the number one contender. Some great appreciation being shown by the crowd here in San Juan, Puerto Rico. Tiffany Stratton trying her damnedest to keep the momentum on her side. That corkscrew off the middle buckle, the same thing that put Cora Jade's lights out. It was enough for her to get sent over the top rope back in Madison Square Garden. The Knight Stratton claimed number one contendership. Off the top again. And another kick out. Tiffany Stratton is trying everything she possibly can, but the naiveness of the young competitor may be getting the best of her. She could not allow this frustration to drive her to a mistake. Back on top she goes. And sidestep goes the champion. Liv Morgan, now more than ever, needs to get back into this match. Code breaker. And will that be enough to retain her title here at Backlash? Not just yet, Stratton's still alive. May not have gotten the victory, but certainly enough to create some distance and try to get Liv Morgan back in the driver's seat. He'll call it high risk, high reward for nothing. Stratton with the crash and burn off the missile drop kick. And it has allowed Liv Morgan to take control of this championship fight. Tiffany Stratton gave everything she possibly had in her arsenal, at least that we know of, at Liv Morgan so far. None of it was enough. Stratton better be racking her brain, trying to pull an ace out of the hole to try to keep down the champion tonight, because if she doesn't come up with a plan B, Liv Morgan may be on the verge of victory. The matters of the events can change in just moments. As these two women wage for war, Stratton muscling up the champion out of nowhere. Liv Morgan to the outside. And here comes Tiffany with the tope suicida. Win, lose, or draw, you best believe Tiffany Stratton is ready to break, break through the glass ceiling. An incredible performance so far tonight here at Backlash, and she is not letting up. Again, continuing the offense on the outside. Liv Morgan creating distance once more. Something that has been a reoccurrence in this match. Stratton may have her bell rung off that elbow. Liv Morgan now. Wait a minute. Into the ropes goes Tiffany. Liv with the oblivion. Desperate times call for desperate measures. Liv going for the kill, and it works in her benefit. You got to give credit where it's due. The number one contender, the buff Barbie, Tiffany Stratton, leaving it all inside the squared circle tonight. But the championship remains with the woman who scratched and clawed for it time and time again. An incredible performance, a bounce back performance by Liv Morgan here in San Juan, Puerto Rico. Here is your The championship remains with Liv Morgan. What was not to be a year ago in her first defense during that reign as champion writes a different story tonight. Liv continuing to prove her doubters wrong and prove her supporters correct. Tiffany Stratton putting up one hell of a fight. But through all the offense of this matchup and the mind games she's tried to play over the last five weeks, it was not enough as Liv Morgan walks into Backlash and walks out of Backlash, still your WWE Women's Champion.